So a few weekends ago, I needed a hand grip to hold my GoPro for filming my kids at our local pool. It needed to be fairly compact in size, but most importantly, it needed to float. The parts cost just under $5, and it's super simple to build. Check out the parts list in the comments below. To start building the hand grip, you'll drill a 1 quarter inch hole in the center of the threaded plug. Then you'll take the bolt and push it through from the inside of the cap through the top. Put the rubber washer over the top of the bolt. This can be purchased, but I made mine from an old bicycle inner tube. Put the metal washer over the rubber washer. And then finally, put the nut on the bolt. Tighten the nut and bolt onto the plug using wrenches to make it secure. You'll want to make sure that it's pretty tight to keep water from going down the bolt hole. At this point, I test fitted the GoPro camera mount to the bolt to make sure that the bolt would fully seat into the GoPro tripod mount. Next, I cut a 1 inch PVC pipe to 6 inches long. I found that 6 inches is the minimum you need to float a GoPro camera, at least the ones that I have. You may want to test that yours floats before gluing together. After the pipe is cut, you are ready to glue the threaded adapter and the cap to the pipe. When gluing on the threaded adapter, you will want to make sure that the glue does not run down onto the threads. Glue on the threads makes it really hard to screw the plug in later on. Also, you want to be as clean as you can with the glue so the finish on the hand grip is clean. Okay, at this point you have a functioning hand grip. You can take the threaded plug and screw it onto the handle. You will find that the threaded plugs do not seat all the way down into the PVC threaded adapter, but that's okay, it's pretty watertight. So to get ready for paint, the nut and bolt should be covered with tape to ensure that the bolt stays clean. After you throw on a coat or two of your favorite color of paint, you are ready to play. I gave mine to my kids and this is what I got. Thanks for watching and please subscribe to my YouTube channel so you can check out my other great YouTube videos on iCreatables TV. If you like this project, perhaps you would like some of my others. You can check them out at my iCreatables TV YouTube channel. I've got a lot of new videos and great content coming up that I want you to be around for. Thanks for watching.